Hey, welcome to the card of the day. Um, one cup of coffee so far. Definitely need more. Okay, Seven of Swords. A very tricky card. Lots of meanings to it. Sometimes when a card comes up with many, many meanings, meanings in a reading, and they're all um, very specific, it's easy for me to connect. This card, when this card comes up, I know where I'm going with the reading. There are, I know it sounds strange. I know it sounds like it should be easier when there's one meaning, but I can easily connect these cards to other around because of so many things. The first being the, these guys here, these tents, T-E-N-T-S. That means that, that this is a temporary situation. This, look at the way he's going back and forth. It's, again, a temporary situation. I don't know where I'm going. I'm going back and forth, back and forth. Look at how he's holding the swords. This is not a swordsman. This is somebody carrying them by the blades, literally stealing them. It's called the thief card. And then back here, behind the scenes, there's a whole battle going on. It's as though the battle is there. This person has come in to steal the swords. They can't decide, should they leave with the five? Should they take the two? You get the feeling. It also goes with uh, not uh, being honest, whether that's for yourself or for others. Also, if you look at his hat, his hat is not, uh, he's not dressed for battle. He looks more like a merchant. Uh, so there's so much in this card that I kind of always feel like when I read it accents other cards very, very well when you can put things together in a reading. So there's your little tarot reading lesson for the day, um, which will, of course, be in my class whenever I get it together. People are rolling their eyes. Your class has been getting together for two years. I know it has. But when I look at this card, uh, someone said something in yoga the other day, and it really inspired me to for today's mantra of the day okay because everything comes down to sort of the same things and one of those is where is our attention um i are we dwelling on things from the past are other people uh, drama queens that are actually getting our attention or we're thinking about them a lot or too much than we should uh, you know anything like that who is stealing our time and energy that's what I'm getting to today. Who, when someone does something, when someone cuts me off in traffic, say, that's someone I don't even know. They're gone. I'm not going to see them again. But sometimes it lingers with me and it makes me furious. And I picture how they could have hit me and I could have been hurt or blah, blah, blah. And they are literally taking my time and energy. So today, I take back my time and energy. That simple. I take back my time and energy. Don't let anyone steal it from you. I take back my time and energy. Where is your attention placed? That's it. That easy. Have a great day, everybody. I'll see you tomorrow.